Yes. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Eva Anthony. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to upload high quality video content on YouTube by um, just tweaking some settings on your YouTube uh, mobile app and you're good to go. If you're interested, you might want to watch this video to the end and consider subscribing if you are new to my channel. And if you're not new to my channel, consider subscribing too because I mean, you've been watching like two, three, five videos of mine and you're still not subscribed. Why? So subscribe to my channel and let's move on into this video. The quality that you use in filming or recording any of your video there are some other things that you need to check there are some other things that you need to note for your video to like come out very crisp and very sharp and very clear and in the highest of qualities there are a lot of things post-production that contribute to this quality what I am talking about here is your camera settings the quality that you use in filming um, if you filmed with great lighting if your video if your content in the first place was taken in perfect conditions now perfect conditions being that your lighting is good your audio is good your um, your makeup is good, your setting is good, your frame rate is good, like everything about that video is on point. Another very important thing is also how you export that particular content after you finish editing. With all of this considered, for most of us, or should I say for myself, I use my phone to film, I use my phone to edit, I use my phone to take pictures, I use my phone to upload, meaning I upload my YouTube videos right from my phone with the YouTube mobile app. For those of you that also upload your videos using your YouTube mobile app, it's very possible that one of the reasons why your videos come out blurry or are not clear after uploading is because of your YouTube upload settings. So here I'm going to be showing you some steps that you need to take to enable you upload quality content that you love and that your audience would also love and appreciate you for. First, I want you to make sure that you are recording in the highest quality that your phone comes in. For iOS users, you might want to tap on your camera in your settings and then click on record video. You will see different frame rates with which you can use to record your video. And I want you to select the highest quality there. And for me, mine is 4K at 60 frames per second. So that is what I use in filming every of my video for android users you might want to go to your camera settings and then click on fhd qhd or uhd now any of these three um settings would actually give you um, a very very high quality but i would suggest at all i would advise that you go with qhd or uhd depending on whichever you have on your phone there are loads of Androids out there and I won't be able to like say specifically how each Android phone comes um, when it comes to their um, camera settings and all of that but I would really appreciate if you can go into your phone go into your camera and try to know which um, frame rate you would want to or which video quality you might want to use to film. I can mostly talk about Samsung because I know Samsung has some of these settings but for any other one I don't think I am I don't think I know where that would be so you might want to go into your phone and like do ultimate search treasure hunt something like that yeah I'm sorry I'm sorry Android users but if eventually I get to find out some other um settings for you guys for android users i am definitely going to put it out in a video and let you guys know yeah the second thing you might want to do is after you finish editing your videos you might want to render or export or save that particular video in the highest quality that um that editing app gives to you this applies to both ios and android users one pro tip that i'm going to give to you is if you film your video in let's say um, 1080p you cannot 
render your video out in 4K because it's either going to get very blurry or it might not even show, it might not even play. So you want to make sure that you render your video, you save your video, you export your video with the same quality with which or in which you use in filming. Now, if for example for me, I film with 4K at 60 frames per second, now I cannot um, um, render or export any of my videos anything less. I might get lucky and then export at 4K at 60 at 30 frames per second, and my video will be good. But I cannot go anything lower. I wouldn't even want to try it. So you might want to think about that. Probably that's one of the reasons why your videos come out blurry and all of that. So yeah, let's move on to the third point. The third point why your video might not be clear or might not have a very good quality after you upload on YouTube is because you have not changed your YouTube settings on your YouTube mobile app. So if you're still having difficult we are still having difficulty with video quality after you've uploaded even though you filmed and exported at the highest quality your phone and your editing software came with now this might be the problem go to your youtube app on your phone and then click at the right hand corner click on your profile picture at the right top corner of your phone scroll down to settings and then go way down to where you see upload quality if you click on that you might you need to click on full quality now, this is one of the reasons why your videos might not have been very clear after you've uploaded on YouTube. Now, some of you might be using the default settings, which is sometimes 1080p or probably 780 and it's very possible that some of you are using 360, which doesn't make sense at all. So, you want to make sure that it is at three at um, full quality this will help you maintain um, your video quality after you upload on YouTube because as you know some of these or most of these um, social media platforms tend to reduce your video quality but now with your settings edited no matter what YouTube takes away from your video it will still be looking good and in its best quality so make sure that you are always going the full quality route and if you have your video quality at 720p come down to full quality that's where all that's where all all the whole fun happens for android users i am sorry that you do not have this option on your youtube mobile app i am very sorry it's not my fault so i do not know how to help you in this case as this doesn't apply to you yet and you can't change your upload quality when it comes to YouTube in the YouTube mobile app and honestly I wonder why but make sure that you follow the other steps the first and second step just so that you have it to the best of your knowledge that no matter what at least you have your videos you filmed your videos at a very great rate and you exported your video at a very high quality so let's see what youtube will take away from it but i assure you that no matter what youtube takes away from that your videos will still come out looking great while we wait for youtube to add that particular feature for you guys on android i hope this video helps you when it comes to your quality and you have gone right ahead to like adjust your quality when it comes to your camera and also your youtube settings you might want to also do this when you export any of your videos like this video drop a comment subscribe if you haven't and i'll definitely see you in my next video